It's our mixed trips 601 final. Looks like we maybe had a slight bump there on the cam. Let's see if we can adjust that here in just a second. Run out there real quick. Alrighty, I tried to make a quick adjustment before these guys got going just so we could have at least most of the board covered, but not as much as we would have hoped, so that's all right. We'll rock with it. Hopefully most of our uh, checkouts are still in place. Looks like it, so that's what we need. This is the finals, the mixed triple 601 finals. William Stewart here of USA Darts Productions. Commentating on this one for you as it's Joe Cheney, Jason Brandon, Sandy Haas taking on the team of Shea Cole, Gary Mawson, and Ken McGowan. Nice ton there for Cheney. Pretty good advantage here for Brandon Cheney and Haas. Currently throwing a 75.33 average. Definitely a long day of action here at the Tuscany Suites and Casino. Starting off with open doubles cricket in the WDF singles event. We've made it all the way to here. Of course, we had women's doubles as well. Women's doubles cricket, that is. Unfortunate round there for Mawson. Just producing 26, really. given an opportunity here to run away with this first leg. Not able to get that third in that 20 bed, but nice little 81. <coughs> Nice 135 from Ken McGowan there. That'll certainly help make a dent. 
Jason Brandon looking for another one of those trips. He does find it. 140 there for him. Leaving 66. No, sorry. 86. My apologies. Six to leave tops there for Cheney. Cole needing to hit a big number and hope that Haas doesn't come up here and nail this double 20. Here we go, double 10 here for Brandon. See if you can put this one in there. There it is, nice shot there from Jason Brandon. He makes this a one nil match in this first to two legs final of a mixed triples 601. Austin stepping in here to lead us off. Starting off with a big trip 20. And another. Can he fill it? He will. Nice big 180 for Gary Mawson. Little 95 there from Joe. Finds him down by a ton in this second leg. Good 121 from Ken McGowan. That really upright angle to his darts. Gary Mawson, 219 needed 
definitely have the advantage here in this leg. After Mawson opened up with that big 180. Shea Cole came back and put in an 81. And Ken McGowan throwing a 1-2-1, one, one, I believe. So really kicking it in gears. The team of Cole, Mawson, and McGowan in this leg year. Even Gary Mawson with 74. Ah, yeah, see, adjustment there made 89 left. I was wondering if it just seemed a little bit off on the 74 score. So get on Sandy to. Adjust that one. Nineteen. Thinks about it. Does he want to go twenty bull? I don't think there's really a need to. But I mean, why not? Maybe take a look at it. I don't think he's going to. Yeah. He kind of thought about it. Smart play just to lay up. Kind of wonder if he should have just went with the trip 10 there instead of the 2010. I wonder if Gary's actually mentioning that in the background there as they're having a talk. Or maybe he's saying just take a stab at it. Why not? Can't hurt, right? <laughs> Double 20 needed for Mawson. Ooh, unfortunate there. Ninety-eight scored. I believe one o two. Sorry, one twelve. Mass getting a little shady. As yeah, I think we've been alive for right around at least twelve hours today. My apologies for the mishap there on the counting. A nice 112. Cheney's perfectly capable of doing this. 12 first dart. <laughs> Cheney takes just a step back, maybe re gripping here, possibly. Looking at the trip 20 here for tops. He's going to have a look. Oh. Definitely wanted it. Fell just a tad bit short. Ken McGowan with five left. One, double, two. So to force the deciding leg inside, double one. Inside as well. So double 10 for Sandy Haas to win the event. She yells out her name on that one. Not happy with exactly where that landed. She'll regroup. Step back here. Gonna get back after it. Double ten. So 
Not able to convert. Mawson steps up. Looking to take out this five, one, double two. Inside as well, double one. Oh, he drops that one. A little bit farther than Kidden. Ken did the last time out, so double 10 here. Jason Brandon looking to use that as a marker. He does exactly that, a perfect marker dart indeed with that first one, and it's going to be the team of Jason Brandon, Joe Chaney, and Sandy Haas winning the event. So great stuff for them. Congrats to that team, and that's going to do it for us here at the Las Vegas Open tonight. Thanks for joining us throughout today's events. We've got some more action coming your way tomorrow around 10 a.m.